Like, uh, like any uh, varied product, which a hardwood floor certainly is, uh, there's, a, there's degrees of durability. Um, and uh, there are pros and cons to, uh, to how hard, for instance, a hardwood floor can actually be. Um, a lot of people like the, soft, the softer end of the spectrum, like American cherry, for instance, uh, and alder. Um, sometimes uh, people appreciate the, the aesthetic of, of, of a hardwood floor that kind of looks lived in. Uh, other people don't. Other people want, the, you know, want it to look exactly the same as it, as it did from the time you installed it to, the, you know, to decades later. Um, and for that, you go up, uh, up the scale. Now, when I'm talking about the scale, of course, I'm talking about the Yanka hardness scale. That's Yanka with a J. Um, basically, it puts all of the, uh, the species of hardwood flooring on, uh, on a spectrum. So, like I said, uh, American cherry would be uh, like 950 on the Yanka hardness scale, for instance. Uh, and, uh, and the higher up you go, the harder the hardwood floor is. So, uh, something like ebony, for instance, would be like 3600 and change. So, the higher you get, uh, the, the harder the hardwood floor actually is. Um, now, there is a bit of a trade-off uh, when you're talking about hardness, and that is that uh, the harder the hardwood floor, the harder it is to cut. So when you're actually trying to install the stuff, uh, it, it, uh, sometimes it takes extra equipment, for instance, uh, to make sure that you can, you can saw through those boards and, uh, and uh, fit them together properly. Um, so it's a bit more work on the installation side. But once they're in, you've got, uh, you've got uh, durability that, uh, <clears throat> that's quite significant. Um, now, the reason that uh, something like uh, oak uh, hardwood floor, for instance, is so popular is that it strikes a balance between the two. Uh, so it's, it's relatively easy to cut and it's relatively durable. So you won't get the denting or whatever it is that uh, can happen on a softer floor. So all these things are uh, to be taken into consideration when you're choosing a species. Uh, and when you are choosing a species, uh, of course, you're not only going for color, uh, and, uh, and grain pattern, which are two important uh, things to, to think about when you're buying, but you're also uh, going for how hard it is to cut, how, how workable it is. So all of these things uh, are, are important to your choice.